Good morning. June 3. June 3? Uh, yeah, Thursday, June 3. Hoffman's Mineral Vlog. Vlog, vlog, vlog. I'm really beat this morning. I slept so much last night. I have not been sleeping this week. I don't know why. Some weeks it's like that. I can get like four hours of sleep, this and that. But last night, as my wife and I were trying to watch Shaft's Big Score, I fell asleep on the couch. I went to bed at like 9.45 p.m. And uh, conked out for nine hours. And you would think now, and then I just, like I just woke up, you'd think I'd be like ready to go, but I am a mess. But uh, you know what I need? I need a liter of mineral water. <coughs> Today's pick. Look at this beautiful bottle. Look at this. That's sleek. Sleek glass. My first glass bottle on episode three of Hoffman's Mineral Vlog. And I believe this is my first still water. My first flat. Um, I am not... I think, by and large, we're going to be mostly sparkling, bubbly, fizzy, gassy here on Hoffman's Mineral Vlog. But once in a while, a still. Once in a while, a flat, you know? Mix it up. Uh, you know, like when you when you think of a great, great, uh, you know, people who know a lot about wine, they mostly deal with reds once in a while, a white, I think. Anyway, today's pick, I don't read Greek, so I can't really pronounce that. But I can tell you in English, it's called Samaria. Samaria from the White Mountains of Crete. The ancient Minoans and the Mycenaeans drank Samaria water. And um, I was Googling uh, this company, Samaria. They probably have a really good market share. They have a very nice website in English and Greek. It's very professional. Uh, relatively new company. Like, unlike, you know, you look at... Uh, some of those, you know, old German ones from the springs, from, you know, the, you know the, the Pope drank this water, you know, from 1402 and whatnot. They're a relatively new company from 1978. There's goats on the website. Crete, you know, that Crete, of course, if you don't know, is an island um, in the Aegean Sea, south of um, Greece. So this is going to be like on a hot, friggin' hot day when you've been battling cyclopses and whatnot you drink this water so let's try it <coughs> let's do it first let me confirm that it's still it may actually be yeah this is still water i'll mix it up i'll do a little still nothing on the cap nothing fancy other than a very hard to read stamp expires when does my water expire ridiculous water doesn't expire uh 24 so that's 322 March 3rd 2022 well, not that long from now all right let's do it it's a beautiful glass bottle still oh I need oh, I'm so hot I've been wandering around the rocks with my friend Perseus this is very wet This is refreshing. This is cold, blank water. You know, you go and get a glass of New York City tap water and it tastes like something. New York City tap water, even though it's flat, although in some parts of Queens it's actually got a lot of fizz in it, um, uh, is, is got, has got punch, it's got flavor, it's got some kind of something going on. This is, this is like the absence of flavor. Oh, it's cold. Holy crap. Now, does this have any, like, um, yeah, it says it's got stuff in there. It's got CA. It's got MG. That's the magnesium. K4? What the hell? Oh, K plus. A little bit of K plus. It's only got 0 0.5 thingamajigs of K plus. Yeah. And then it's all in Greek. I love the Greek lettering. Nothing beats it. Because every now and then you'll be looking at Greek, and there'll be a triangle. 
What's better than that? It's like we're not even going to make a letter. We're not even going to try to make a letter. It's just a triangle, the most basic shape. It's like why does it have a dot in the middle of the thing or a line? There's one thing better than the Greek triangle. Russian, sometimes you'd be looking at Russian and there's a three. I love that. You see that in old Russian movies, <clears throat> you know, opening credits. Oh, and there's like a bunch of threes on the screen. This is cold, refreshing, tasteless water. I'd drink it again because you know you're getting the real deal from the Cretan Mountains. That's probably beautiful there. <clears throat> um, what was I going to say? Yeah, we got more on deck coming in. Because I've been getting a lot of notes saying what's going on. And I'll tell you, we got some really good waters coming in from all over the world. All over the world. It's terrific. Samaria. Here's something I've learned, and perhaps if you've watched all these episodes, you recognize it too. Drinking still water first thing in the morning is easier than drinking um, sparkling. I'm, I'm, I'm cruising this morning. Championship. I love it. This is good. <clears throat> This is a good, this is a good choice when you want tasteless blank water. Give me a glass of blank water. I love this. If, I don't know if you can see on the label. It's got more of these phony baloney medallions. These are all fake. They're all fake. We can't prove any of these. This one says, well, it's so small. Mond Selection. That's, uh, you know, this is French. The Grand Gold Quality Award. It's so small, I can't even see where it's from. 2019. This says Taste Institute. Taste Institute. Brussels. Superior Taste Award. 2019. Bullshit. It's a friggin' lie. And this one is so tiny, I can't even read it. It's just got a little medallion in... Um, there's some kind of letter in here. I see the word spring. I don't know what that is. I don't believe any of those. Gould and Mustard with their bunch of medallions on the mustard from the Mustard Awards. Give me a break. He won a sandwichy. Where's she going? All right, listen. So um, it's now uh, Thursday. I got to get my day going. Let's just very quickly see what's in the news today. Because we got a little time. Uh, today's paper, The Taking of Transit 1... Oh, shit. Suspected China hackers tap into MTA servers. That's not good. Is that true? Look at this picture. This Matrix crap. <laughs> BB foes strike to end rain. You know what the worst thing about Benjamin Netanyahu is? Well, one of them. This is not the worst thing. This is a silly thing. And there's actual real bad things about him. But among the bad things about Bibi Netanyahu is that um, when you say Bibi, you think of him. When you say Bibi, you should be thinking of Bibi King. He should really disappear. That car is just driving backwards. That car is just cruising down a Queen Street backwards. Today's going to be nuts. Yesterday was all right. I got a few things accomplished. Today, I don't know. I got I got this big project I got to do, and I don't know where to start. B.B. Netanyahu is a schmuck, and he's not a righteous man. He's not a righteous man. His wife is not a righteous woman, and his son is a real, real piece of work. A real Shonda for the Goyim. 
But among his crimes is he has taken away from the public BB should be BB King, Blues Boy King, who I had the good fortune to see perform live on more than one occasion. I saw him at what today is now called the PNC Bank Art Center in Homedale, New Jersey. At the time, it was called the Garden State Art Center. And he was great. He was everything you'd want him to be. B.B. King was a great man. Well, I don't know if that's true. B.B. King was a great performer. I don't know anything about his personal life. Well, I know that he played for the Prisoners. That was a thing that... That album, the Cook County Jail, man, that's a good album. That's as good as... It's funny because they're so different, but they're so similar. Uh, Johnny Cash at San Quentin and B.B. King at Cook County Jail. I wonder which was first. I should know that. I really don't know. It would be funny if they came out around the same time. Uh, if you haven't heard, that's the lesson of today. More than Samaria water, which is just cold, empty, blank water. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, a, a void of taste. Which is, a, which is sometimes what you need in a good water. Better than a bad tasting one. Let's sum it up here. Today, when you're done listening to my vlog, check out BB King. At, at uh, Cook County Jail. What a record, man. It's so good. And BB Foes. Yeah, it looks like he's out. Although, who knows? Everybody, this guy's this guy's like a bad penny, right? He'll be back. And because he, he's... Yeah, let's see what they say. His foe's making the deal. Look, there they're making the deal. Those are the BB Foes. We must make the deal. All right, have a great day. Drink some water, listen to B.B. King. I'll talk to you another time. See you tomorrow.